Welcome to Jammin' with Jamantha. Our guest today has been a trusted source of honest, compelling, and weirdly popular documentary films in Strongburg. A supposed guiding light of truth, but most likely a purveyor of bullshit. She speaks of me. She speaks of Lamont Brickwater. Hey, Lamont. Lamont. I love you, Lamont. As you should. These folks are phony as fuck. Laser hush. Whoa! Um, welcome to the show, Lamont. Jamantha, I love when people gather to talk about my greatness. We love you, Lamont! That is what this is, right? Of course. This is about your work and its massive influence on Strongberg. Of course. Continue, please. Now, would you say, for the worst? Uh Uh-huh. Well, I wouldn't say that at all. Interesting. Let's take a look at your first feature film, The Mental Health of Bees. After centuries of isolation, bees are starving for affection and companionship. That's a bunch of bull****, Lamar. These bees will all die if we don't learn to hug them. You ever think about that? Strongberg, don't let the bees die. Hug these bees. Hug them tight. Come on. I hate eating here. So you're very proud of that film? As proud as a bouncing billionaire baby breakdancing in a church full of snakes. That film inspired a movement. It did inspire the Huggabee campaign, Yay! which in turn resulted in the Huggabee campaign massacre. Now, w- wait a minute. I'm tired of dying. Owie! These bees don't want hugs. They don't want hugs at all. That man told us that bees need hugs. And they all believed him. Like Nitty. (laughs) We all learned and lived through it, and that's what matters. 